my channel. It's been a very long time since I have vlogged or filmed anything. So um, today is just going to be a trial run, I guess, to see if I can get back into swing of things. It has been a really long time, like months, since I have filmed or vlogged. Not months, I guess a month. It's been a month since I've vlogged anything. Um, the reason for this is there's just a lot of family life things going on right now. And we're not in the best of times right now. So we're just, I was just trying to take a break, gather my thoughts, didn't want everything online, you know, um, just keeping our personal life personal for a little bit. And I hope you guys really understand that and know where I'm coming from. So we just got done at the gym. Aubrey's at daycare. I have Maverick in the back seat. Um, we went to the gym, as you guys seen. It is really hot in here now. Uh, and now we are at Chick-fil-A because I picked up me a egg white sandwich because I was really hungry. So that's about it. I have a lot of things going on today, a lot that I'm not going to be able to share with you guys, but a few of the things that I am going to share with you guys is we're about to head to in into town. Yeah, <laughs> about a 45 minute drive to go to Target and um, maybe get Maverick a haircut if we can. Um, Best Buy maybe if I can't find what I need at Target. And maybe once upon a child. Because I gotta get the kids some clothes because they're growing out of stuff so fast but yeah we got a lot of little running around to do today I uh, already had a doctor's appointment but I don't think we're gonna go it was just a little checkup and I'm wanting to change doctors so I think I'm just gonna hold off and take her another day up to the new doctor that I'm trying to get her in at the second part of the day is gonna be really really busy for me I have a lot of meetings and um, important things to I don't know, really hard to explain. Basically, I'm gonna be busy probably about two to five until I go pick up Aubrey. So that part, I'm not gonna be vlogging. I'm not gonna be talking to you guys about, sorry. Hope you guys understand. Um, but I'm gonna show you what me and Maverick get into today until we go pick up Sissy later. But like I said, right now, I'm just eating my egg white sandwich, drinking my Coke Zero, and then we're gonna head into town. So 45 minute drive. I'm hoping Maverick sleeps the whole time. I don't have makeup on today. My hair's not done. I haven't done my hair and makeup in probably about a week now, and I'm not going to. I'm just <laughs> not in the mood to. I don't care. Sorry. It's been a tough. It's been a tough couple months. So <laughs> I hope you guys, like I said, understand, and I hope you make sure you hit that subscribe button and also like this video if you enjoy these kind of videos and if you want to stay up to date on my life, like as much as I want to share honestly like um there are a lot of big things that are coming a lot of changes that are about to happen a lot of emotional things i'm just not quite prepared to share everything yet so yeah um but i would really really love it if you could hit that subscribe button i am going to try to get back on a schedule with my youtube at least two videos a week i'm not going to shoot for three or more I'm not going to do that right now just i'm in school too much going on I'm not going to do it so I'm going to hope for two, two videos a week and I got a lot of things on my mind of what I want to film and what I want to show you guys. So yeah, I'm going to stop rambling now and eat my sandwich and then let's go into town. I'm currently watching the Casper family. I love the Casper family. I think she is awesome. I don't remember her name. Though. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm watching right now. Here at Target now, loading up on stuff. So we got pizzas. Found this cool um, house mats. Lots and lots of other stuff in here. Lots of stuff in the bottom. I found a new blanket for Aubrey in the dollar spot. So, just trying to keep this in the tank. And now we gotta get a few more groceries and we're done. And we also already paid for a bunch of electronics in the back. So we just have to go up there and pick them up when we get done. That way I didn't have to push around two carts. <laughs> so, yeah. This is what we're doing. Stocked up on diapers and wipes. Yep. So 
Now let's get Daddy's orange juice. This is a rug I got, the outdoor rug. This is Home Sweet Home. I think it's so cute. These are on sale for like $11, which is an awesome deal. I got these two Canon printers and then two HP Chromebooks. So, yeah. That's why I had to have two buggies. This buggy and that one. <laughs> and I had to have somebody help me bring them out. So now I'm gonna try to find room for the rest of this stuff, all these diapers and everything, because all this is going to someone that's having kids um, and needs it more than we do. So I have to put all this up here in just a few. But I'm running out of room in my Suburban. Like, this is getting crazy. So I got the front seat, two car seats, and then the whole back seat is just full of stuff. Oh, great. So let's get loaded up, right? And then we're gonna go shopping. Do a little bit more shopping. Yeah. <laughs> you can eat the camera, silly. It's a camera. What are you doing? What are you doing? Are you happy, boy? Do you, have you been eating some gummies? Yeah. <laughs> wow. This is why every mom needs a big vehicle, a big bus. Oh, that's so. Cute. Oh my goodness, that is so cute. <laughs> is it already recording? Yeah. Oh, I don't mind. This is first haircut time. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. He just looked right at the camera as soon as she did it. Okay, so we'll use my clippers. Okay. There. You wanna see? You wanna feel? Look. See? Whoa. I feel it. Oh, you can't have it. <laughs> Okay. We'll bring y'all up just a little bit. Okay. Look. Look at yourself. Look, going up. Look. <gasps> Whoa. Taller. Yeah. All right. This is what I'm scared I'm of. Right of. here. You want to go shorter? Uh, yes. clothes because I did so cool with my haircut. Yeah. So I just got home and this is everything I got from Target besides the computers because they're still in the car. Um, <clears throat> but I think I showed you guys that. I just got home, ate lunch, just reheated some dinner from yesterday. 
and yeah just got Maverick down for a nap so I thought I'd show you everything that I got which wasn't much but I just want to show you anyways I got a few packs of diapers I also have another pack of these Huggies but they're still in the car because I gotta take them to Aubrey's preschool. And then I also got a big box of overnight diapers size six for Aubrey. Um, she is almost completely potty trained, but they were having such a good deal on diapers right now that I went ahead and picked up some boy ones um, for Maverick because, I mean, he'll be in size six eventually and he's good. We have plenty of diapers up till size six. So I just went ahead and stocked up on some size six ones. Um, and then I also got some wipes because you know why we go through wipes. Anyone kids knows you go through wipes really, really fast. So I got three of these three packs of wipes and then one single pack. And the reason I don't like this and the reason I got these little things is because this is just what I had coupons for. Um, and they're doing a thing if you spent $75, you got $15 back. So with my coupons, I was able to use more coupons and save more money by doing it like this. So I had like a 50 cents off coupon and... All kinds of stuff but for bath items I got a bubble bath a two-in-one shampoo and conditioner a skin nourishing um, body wash and then Aubrey's detangler spray I love this detangler spray but Aubrey got a hold of it last night and opened it up and poured it all over the floor so <laughs> um, I got her a new one of these I'm just gonna start keeping it in the bathroom and not in her bedroom Moving on, I found this cute little blanket for Aubrey. She loves fuzzy blankets. And we're gonna be traveling a lot. Um, well, not a lot, but we travel a lot anyways. So I got this, I thought it was so small and perfect for putting in her backpack. For Chad, I got him some orange juice. He drinks orange juice every morning. I got myself some Dunkin' Donuts creamer. The kids, some of these um, Danimal smoothies. We've never tried these, but I figured they might like them. And then lastly, I found this in the dollar spot. There's these measuring cups that are marble colored. They're plastic and really cheap feeling, but I just thought they were so cute. Rose gold handles and marble cups. And I hear Maverick talking up there. So that is everything I got from Target besides the printers and the computers, which are still in the car. So now I'm going to show you what all I got from Carter's. Pretty much the only reason I ran into Carter's was because Maverick got a haircut and he had hair all over him and it was really bugging him. So Carter's was right next door so I ran in and got a couple things. Um, all this was on clearance and then with clearance they also had an additional 20% off. So it was a really great deal. Um, I found these onesies, they're size 18 months. He's still in 12 month but I went ahead and picked these up because he needs some. Um, he's got plenty of 12 month old clothes but not very much 18 month old clothes. Up oh, there, sorry. <laughs> Not very many 18 month old clothes. So, tough like dad. Um, these little, little dozers and all kinds of stuff. Yeah. And Chad drives a lot of this equipment. So, I thought it was cute for him. This is just a plain gray one, I think. Oh. Oh, dirt magnet. That's cute. And a plain strapped one. And then this one has dozers and dump trucks and stuff on it and excavators so I thought this was just perfect for Maverick um, and it was $12.99 and then an additional 20% off awesome deal and then next I got these onesies they're just long sleeve onesies a basic orange striped this really cute one has giraffes on it and then this green striped one so really really basic and there was also another one but he's wearing it right now I think it has elephants on it maybe I don't know you'll see it here in just a few minutes um but four came on this pack and I think oh I don't know what happened to the tag I think these were $9.99 last piece of clothing I got is this cute little church church outfit so it's just a long sleeve college shirt and overalls and then some cute pants and this was $11.99 with 20% off and I got size 24 months, and this way I can save it for the Christmas time next year. And the very last items I got are these cute little activity pads. I just thought Aubrey would absolutely love these. Um, I got an activity pad in the past that she used when we went to Wisconsin last time. And she really liked it, so I found these smaller ones. And they have the handles like she likes, so 
I got those. I got two of them for. They're $3.99 and then an additional 20% off. So look, I did not want to take a nap. <laughs> Why didn't you want to take a nap? And so this is the other one that came in that pack. It's got little elephants on it. I just thought it was so cute. Hey, 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 let go, let go. Let go, let go. Hey, you wanna go play? <laughs> See how you like my new haircut? Styling. Hey, 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 hey. Bye, <laughs> Crazy hair. Alright, we just got home. We got Aubrey here. Aubrey! Her hair is a mess after preschool. Yeah, that's all y'all's birthday stuff. So I was going to show you everything that we got at Goodwill. And that's Aubrey's art stuff. Um, Goodwill and CVS. As you can see, I got lots and lots of pizzas. So give me one second and I'll show you everything we got. With CVS, I just got the deal on DiGiorno pizzas. They came out to be about $3 a piece, which is an awesome deal. They're normally $5.40 something a piece. So we eat a lot of pizzas. <laughs> we love um, these pizzas. Just super easy. Like we're going to have one tonight. So I'm going to go ahead and set one aside for tonight. So I got these. They came out to be about $3 a piece. And I found two Gillette shavers. Um, which the end price came three seventy five a piece, so um, not great. I've got them for free and a dollar a piece before, but Chad really said he needed some. What's wrong? You ready to take it off? Okay. Okay. There you go. All right, let's get up here now. <laughs> so um, I went ahead and picked those up. I thought they were a decent deal. Not too bad when they're normally um, $14, $14, $15. Aubrey's being really moody, so I'm gonna have to hurry through this. But I found this cute little poncho, I think that's what they're called. Um, it's in size 2T, which Aubrey is almost completely grown out of, but I thought it was just so cute. It was only a dollar, so I couldn't pass it up. Found Maverick some pants for when he gets a little bit bigger. They're by Carter's and 2T, so it'll be another year. But this is, these are perfect snow pants. So that's why I got this for him. Next for Maverick, I found this um, long sleeve onesie. It says built tough like my daddy. So this is perfect for him. Um, he's not quite an 18 month, but he'll be in there pretty soon. So that should be a good one for him. Next I found this tank top for Aubrey, which is in size six. So it's gonna be a while before she can wear it, but it was really cute and only a dollar. Couldn't pass it up. Found these awesome pants. They're like legging material, but they look like jeans. Um, size 40, so she'll be in these in probably maybe a year or so, six months to a year. Next for Aubrey, I found these really cute pants. Um, they're so thick and nice, like really good quality. There's a brand Baby Gap in size three years. So these are gonna be perfect for her. Like she could wear these now. She's over here playing with all of her artwork <laughs> from school. Yeah, see, so pretty. Yeah. Her teacher is brave letting her do glitter stuff. Um, next I found this little Carter's baby set. And I got this just because it's brand new. Like as you can see, it's brand spanking new. And I just thought it was so cute. But neither one of my kids can wear this. So I'm thinking I'm just going to save it and give it as a gift. It was only $1. And um, my friend is having her baby like probably next week. So it's perfect for her. Also for my friend, um, her little baby is going to be a boy. So I found a couple shirts. Hold on one second. So I found these really adorable Under Armour onesies. I think this might be the last thing I got Aubrey. And it's this really thick Hello, sweatshirt with a big butterfly on it. Hello, it's in size um, five years and it's by Baby Gap. There was so much Baby Gap stuff there um, that I wish I could have got her that was size 2T. But I didn't get because, well she's almost out of 2T and I figured it'd be a waste, uh -huh. a waste of money. <laughs> First thing I found for myself is this shirt that says, Oh, hell no. I just thought it was so funny. Um, it's 
short in the front, long in the back, and it is the softest material ever. Now, I'm not really sure what this brand is, but it's really soft, and I love it. I tried it on, and it fits me perfectly. Next shirt I got is this very see-through um, sheer. I think this is size extra large. Um, yeah, extra large by Vineyard Vines. Vineyard Vines. I, don't know. I see this brand everywhere, but I just thought it was so cute, and it's really, really soft and good quality. So I got it. I figured it's really large, so I'm going to wear it as like a beach cover-up or. Um, just as just a lazy day t-shirt pretty much because it's so lightweight and next I found this Under Armour tank top I don't know why I won't focus but it's just a gray plain Under Armour tank top um, why are you not focusing but yeah as you can see right there I actually would not know the brand if it wasn't for the Under Armour symbol because they cut off the tag so I'm not even really sure what size it is but it fits like I tried it on and I'm, I normally wear a size medium and it fits pretty good. I mean, it might be a large, but it fits really good. Nice quality, perfect condition. So, yeah, got that. The last shirt I got is just this um, plaid shirt, button-up shirt. I normally leave these unbuttoned and just wear a tank top underneath it and just use it as a little cover-up. Um, not really sure what the brand is. But it's so lightweight and soft. And the other one I have is thicker and like really hard to move in. So I got this one because it's just, it just seems so much more comfortable. I am so excited about this dress I found. It had, it's brand new with the tags by Lauren James. I'm not really sure. Honestly, never heard of this brand. So don't know if it's a good brand. But I tried this dress on. And it is absolutely beautiful. I love it so much. It's not sheer. So you can't see through it and it's not um too short so it goes past my fingers actually so and i'm very tall so it's really hard for me to find a dress but this one fit me perfectly and it's going to be perfect for the spring summertime so i love it i'm really really happy about this find um their dresses are about four dollars so a four dollar dress is kind of amazing so brand new with tags this one also has a beautiful shape to it, which is what I've been looking for because I've lost all my baby weight. I'm actually <laughs> losing too much weight now, but um, yeah, anyways, I don't really have my pouch anymore. So I wanted some more form-fitting dresses and I fell in love with this dress. It's very perfect. I mean, it's just perfect for church. Um, covers everything long. Um, yes, and once again, it goes past my fingertips. But on camera, it kind of looks really short. <laughs> I feel like this video is going on forever. But this is my very last dress. This is another very church appropriate um, dress. And it's got beautiful, beautiful details here. So I absolutely love it. And once again, this one is not see-through. But you definitely can't wear black underwear under it. Because I had black underwear on. And it was kind of, I mean, you could, you could tell I had black underwear on. Um... I don't know the brand yeah. of this. There's actually not. Yep, that dress has no brand whatsoever. So I'm not sure what it is, but I just know it's really beautiful. My outfit of the day is just, and what it is 90% of the time, was just a t-shirt and some pants. And I had some boots on. It's so very casual. Maybe one day I'll actually do my hair and makeup again, but who knows. Here's what Aubrey was getting into <laughs> while I was doing the video. <laughs> so this is what you seen earlier in the video these little um, fun pouches or fun packs activity packs she loves them unfortunately it didn't last very long hey can you say hey your, your hair is crazy uh oh uh oh there's tear uh. yeah hey don't stick it on the table okay I haven't been in a shopping mood in a very long time, so the bug just hit me today and I went crazy. Like, I don't know, I went a little crazy, but it's okay. Um, let Bella in. Hello, Chris Stapleton. How do you do? I don't know if, how many of you have seen our pig, but we got a new pig. Her name is Mommy. Bella, and Mommy. she's crazy. So. <laughs> what? Oh, I see. It's so pretty. Showing everybody. Are you showing everybody? Oh no. Oh no, you dropped it? It's okay. Mm. There you go. Alright, 
Mommy's gotta go do laundry now, okay? Mommy, who? I see, yeah. You did so pretty. Are you gonna show Daddy when he gets home? This is the worst. Are you gonna show Daddy your pictures when he, when he gets home? He's on his way. Dinner is ready. And Aubrey is eating a slice of pizza. <laughs> She's peeling all the cheese off of it. Is it still hot? Still hot? Yeah. Alright, so I'm going to sit down and eat dinner and watch cartoons with Aubrey until she goes to bed. Um, her normal bedtime is 6, 6.30, but tonight I am letting her stay up till about 7.30. If she can, but she's starting to get a little antsy um, because we're waiting for Chad to get home and I want him to be able to see her for at least a few minutes. Um, but when he gets home, I just need to take a shower and get ready for bed and I'll probably work on homework, work on school stuff until we go to sleep. But yeah. So we're about to head to bed now watching the news because apparently there's a big snow, um, a cold weather warning coming in. And it's supposed to be the coldest weather in like 20 years. So we're keeping an eye on that. I don't think it's going to hit us very hard, but we're still keeping an eye on it. I might not have school tomorrow. Who knows? But currently just doing laundry. So I have this huge mess of laundry and all that is my school stuff. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to stay up for a little bit, do all this laundry and... That's about it but I'll see you guys tomorrow maybe I'm thinking about vlogging but if so then you'll see it in a couple days but I'm gonna go ahead and sit down edit this video do all this stuff and go to bed but I hope you guys did enjoy this video um it's a little weird being vlogging again but I hope you did enjoy it and if you did make sure you give it a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button Bye.